I didn't see you there. Well, hi guys, I'm Trista, and welcome to the channel, Trista Some Videos. So, today I'm doing something different, and no, I'm not doing my quarantine routine again. I am going to be doing my first ever coding video that I've posted on YouTube. So, I am going to be teaching you how to make an age converter app, even if you don't know how to code at home. So basically, all you need to do is go to a website and it's really easy to do. So basically what an age converter is, is it's like basically like a calculator, but instead of calculating everything, it's more simpler to make and it only calculates how many hours old you are. For example, if you're 10 years old, it's going to calculate how many hours old you are. So coding is not that hard. It's not rocket science. So I'm just going to be showing how to do it, even if you don't know how to code. So let's go. So now I'm going to teach you guys how to do the age calculator. So basically you're on google.com, right? So then you go to code.org and then it's right over here. So it's so if you're not signed in to code.org, it's going to say that you have to sign in here. But I'm already signed in, so now you go to projects, which is up here. And today we're going to be using App Lab. So just go to App Lab to make a new project. So the project's loading. So first we're gonna start with the design. And but before that we have to name our project. So I'm going to name my project a calculator. And then we're just gonna save it. So it's saved. And now we're going to start with the design. So first, you're going to need to add a label. And I'm going to put my label on the top over here. So I'm just going to change the text color first. And I'm going to make it black. There. So I'm going to change the text inside, and I'm going to write... H H calculator there and I'm gonna change the font size. I'm gonna make it 20, but you can make it any size you want. So H calculator. Just gonna align it in the middle. And uh, you can just make your background white. I'm just gonna make it mine like a little Teal, yeah, this type of teal, yeah, perfect. And I'm gonna add another label. So, in total, you're gonna need like five, five labels, one text input, and one button. So, you can just get another uh, label, or you can do this thing like a you can just duplicate it and change the the text inside so you don't have to change the color and the font all over again. So I'm just going to put type your so I'm just going to type in here and I'm going to say type your age in years, years here. And this there. And I'm going to change the font size a little bit because I want to make it smaller than the title. 
15. So I'm just going to put it right under here. And under that, I'm going to put a text input. So the person who's using this can input their text here. So I'm just going to make it black. And you can add a placeholder if you want, but I'm not going to. So just I'm going to align it here. And then we're going to need a button to calculate all of the results. So how to calculate. So I'm just going to write calculate in there. And I'm going to make the button a different color. So I'm just going to make it like uh, maybe uh, pink maybe? Sure. Yeah, that's good. I'm just going to align it in the middle. You don't have to align all of yours in the middle. I'm just doing it because this is the type of way I want to make it. And that's done for that. And we'll need two, no, not buttons, two more, three more labels. So you can just get another label, or like I said before, you can just duplicate these labels, duplicate, and I'm just going to change the text, I'm going to write, you are, I'm just going to do it like that, so I'm just going to align it here, make a duplicate one again, so here you're not going to write any text at all, because this is where you're going to write how many hours old they are. So you'll need a little bit of coding to do that. So just make it a little big so that if it's a big number, it's going to fit. So just a little, little bit larger. Yeah, perfect. And duplicate this to make. And then I'm going to write our, hours old. So basically it's going to say you are blank hours old. Like how many ever hours old you are. Like calculating. So, so we're done with the design part. Now we need to do the coding part. So you have all of these controls. So first you're going to put an event. So when... So you're going to put your button, so whenever you click button 1, then it's going to do some stuff. So you have to put, you have to get a set text, and then, so if you, if you want to put text in this one, you have to set for label 4, so you can put this text. But we won't be putting any text, we're going to need to do some math. So since we're calculating the hours, we're going to do, we're going to take another one of these math ones and put it inside of that. And we're going to do 365, because there's 365 days in a year, and there is 24 hours in a day. And we're going to do that times how many ever years they type in here so you're going to go back to ui controls and then you're going to put get text so whatever text is in this place will be multiplied by 365 by 24 and i'm just going to put my text input so that's all the coding you'll need for that. It's pretty simple. So now we are going to run it. So let me just move my camera here. Okay. Um. So I'm just going to press run. 
and now let's check if it works. So let's say I'm like seven years old. Let's calculate. I am 61 and this is not hours old. So let's see if that's correct. Seven. So it would be seven times. 24, 24 times 365, which would equal the same exact number. So that's how you check if it actually works or not. So that's how to make an age calculator, basically, without even having to know coding. Well, I hope you liked the video, and wait, don't go anywhere, I'm going to give you a task. So from now on, at the ending of my videos, I am going to be giving you all a riddle. And whoever the whoever answers the riddle in, in the first 24 hours of me posting my video down below in the comment section, it gets they get a shout out in the next video. So multiple people can get shout outs. So make sure to type the answer below. So the first riddle of the day is. I am white when I am dirty, and I am black when I am clean. What am I? So, make sure to type the answer down below in the comment section to get a shout out. Well, thanks for watching. See you in the next video. And make sure to subscribe and hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. And hit the notification bell to get notified every time I post a video. So, see you guys in the next video. Bye!